What's going on guys and welcome back to Vimcraft and today I'm here with H Bomb and uh we're gonna be doing a little bit of a server tour. Yeah. And uh yeah, we're starting here at spawn <laughs> and um we're starting here with the forgotten sheep farm. Everyone forgets about this bad boy. This took so long to make, but uh it doesn't seem to get enough use. I'll be using it, don't worry. Okay, that's good. It's, it's and give me um some time. it's just a large grass area with a bunch of sheep. A lot of you guys might not have seen this because I built it back in like episode three or four, long time ago. Did you have enchantments when you dug that out or no? Um, I had like very, very, I think I had an efficiency three um, iron pick or something like that. Oh, something God. pretty bad. That's a nightmare. But um, <laughs> yep, these are all the spawn plots. This is Poke's unfinished shop. This it's one over like here a is. handle right now. <laughs> yep. This one over here is Zealous's modern shop. Mm hmm. It's, it's very nice, stuff. but. I don't know what he's uh, selling it. I think it's just an empty building. He reminds me so much of Corrales when he builds. Yeah, he's very good at building. I'll give him that. Yeah. <laughs> this one over here is mine. I'm dominating the server economy. Yeah, you are. You have, like, all my diamonds. Mm hmm Go check Those your are... payment chest. Or your... Uh, okay, let's go do that real quick. I know where it you... is. I'm following you. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows where it is ever since I showed it in the video. Yeah. All right. So, in this chest, I have 16 diamonds. Those are, like... 14 of yours <laughs> and like two of tipsies mm -hmm. and like oh, almost three stacks of irons that's pretty good yeah i threw in a tip there in case you didn't notice i heard about that <laughs> and uh we have chris's, iron. yep we have chris's iron shop over here i think he's opening that pretty soon yep and just some basic public service stuff crafting table furnace all that good stuff over here and uh tipsies enchanting room right there i guess yep i got and, uh, so many comments about me not knowing Minecraft for mass shop. Yep, I saw those comments, <laughs> and uh, let's go into the nether hub, I guess. Uh, Chris told me about it before all of them, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, oh, that shop was mine. I'm like, oh. Yep, uh, you're and invisible. then we have uh, our nether hub here. What just happened? Uh, you were invisible. Okay, darn it. Yeah. I guess that's a glitch in the new snapshot. When you go into the nether, there's a chance of becoming invisible on servers. Yeah, and so, I saw uh, you make this, too. Yep, in the middle, we got our uh, ender dragon monuments and all our portals around and How i guess we'll start with tipsies the date that you killed it okay so we recorded it like a couple days or a day before and i'm not sure what day we actually recorded <laughs> but no we one. uploaded it like a couple days after no one on the server knows mm -hmm. okay so let's go into tipsies portal it's not too long but no. uh yeah his uh tunnels in the works there his is actually bigger than regulation size. It actually affected the building of my tunnel, but that's yeah, okay. I heard about that. <laughs> mm -hmm. And uh, his portal actually ends right inside a nether fortress. So if you ever need to get into a fortress, just go through Tibsy's tunnel. I think I left that open. <laughs> mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, Tibsy's base is on the water, which is pretty cool. I yeah, actually really like it. It's really different. It's done a nice job. Oh, and, God, uh, Zellos. Mm hmm. Oh, and uh, he has a again. huge chicken farm. Some cows. Oh, you're, I'm invisible again? Yep. Nether portal glitches. Alright, so he's got cows and sheep. Oh. I just came in and there was like hundreds of mobs up in this mob trap. Yep, he was the he's the only one on the server to have a dark room mob trap. So if you ever need gunpowder, this is the place to go. Mm -hmm. He's got over a stack, I bet, I think. Yeah. Huh. And, uh... Yeah, I like his farm area. I think he should put, like, covers over this. Maybe it, make this into a building. Yeah, Grape was doing something really cool the other day that I saw, like, uh, building a uh, pathway or whatever on water. I can't remember the name of it. Yeah, I think he's going to make it into, like, a pirate ship area bay sort of thing. Mm -hmm. But uh, you got, you guys get the idea for Tibsy's base. He's building on the water. Yep. He's got a donkey over there. I nice. Like Did he get that from you? Uh, no, he had it before I was on here. Yeah, we all know you have, like, 20 donkeys. <laughs> I have so many horses. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I saw that video. Oh, God. Okay, so this is not too long of a tunnel, so you want to go into my tunnel next? Mm-hmm. Are you invisible again? Uh, I'm right next to you. <laughs> yep, you're invisible. Anyway, okay. Just wait. We'll meet each other at your yeah, base. Let's go, to, uh, let's go through my tunnel here, and um, since my house is really far from my portal... You might have to uh, kind of skip the way up there. Okay. So uh, my tunnel, you guys have all seen this, but uh, on H's channel you probably haven't. It looks like a mine shaft. Yeah, you did a really good job with this. Yeah, it turned out pretty well. I'm happy with it. I actually uh, got a bunch of suggestions and a live stream from all the viewers. It was really awesome. Hey, you're visible again. Really? 
Yeah, you just you just appeared in front of me. Well, that's awesome. I didn't know you could reappear. And you're magician. Inv you're uh, invisible again. So oh if we go behind my portal, you'll uh, see my horse stable there. Pretty mm -hmm. basic design. Bullseye. We got the oh, yep horse armor on all these. Pretty Mine. sweet. Magnus and uh, buckles. Buckles, yes. And then um, we got a farm, a sugar cane stuff, and some dogs. But uh, the real stuff is up in the treehouse. So uh, why don't we uh, meet you guys back when uh, we're up there? Because it takes a while. Yep, be right back. All right, we're up in my treehouse here. And uh, it is nighttime, so clouds might get in the way. But um, I think my place is pretty cool. What do you think? It's amazing. Mm. I'm very happy with it. It's turning out great. So this is my little bedroom area. Got a nice record player with some CDs in here. Oh, let's take a look. I want to make one of those uh, record farms. Yeah. Fill up my uh, fill up my chest. Season one, I had a huge supply of it. Yeah, I remember that. I and, had like um, a, sp a skeleton spawner next to uh, my mob trap, so I was it was easy records. Or that's whatever. genius, actually. I might try to do that with um, if I find a skeleton spawner. So, yeah. um, this is my automatic storage room. And, uh, yeah, what you do is you take an item, you place it in this chest, and then it'll sort it into the, uh, into the corresponding chest. And if the item does not fit into one of these chests, it'll go into this miscellaneous chest here. All right, we're going to have to prove it. Okay. It's got to be All done. All right, let's take the, uh, let's do sand. Okay, right, so forward. notice how there's two stacks in the sand chest right now. Where is it? Oh, there it right is. Right on the right. Okay, two we'll stacks. We'll toss something into this chest, and you hear that clicking? Yeah, what was that? That was uh, comparators going off. And give it a sec, and it's filling um, up. <laughs> I have no idea how comparators work. It's uh, it's not that complicated. It seems really complicated. Once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. Mm -hmm. And these are like trap chests too, right? Mm -hmm. Trap chests with normal chests next to them to maximize storage space. Very nice. All right, let's move on. All right, so let's head down the staircase. Just jump off here. Ugh. Oh god, there's no just like easy way to Okay, yeah, there is. <laughs> okay, so over here there's nothing. I haven't decided what to put. What Monument if we age. Come... Mm -hmm, definitely. Yep. Just a giant <laughs> and, statue uh, of me. If we come down the right here, we have this m pointless overhang, but it looks nice. It looks amazing. I love uh, the cocoa just... beans. There's a really cool That's they add a very nice touch to the building actually. I want to use them more. Yeah. Over here we have Maya, super smelter. Mm -hmm. What you do is you put your uh, smelting item in here and your coal in the lower chest. Then you uh, click these two powered rails and they go back and forth and evenly dispense both coal and the smelting item into the furnaces. So That's awesome. Works nicely. What's the back one for? Is that coal? or? Yeah, that's coal because um, when you put coal into furnaces, they have to go in a, to the back of the furnace, I believe. Because oh, really? you know how there's two slots, you know? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah, interesting. That confused me the first time, but got to figure <laughs> it out. Okay, nice little overhang over this. That's new, by the way. Come down the staircase and we'll go to the enchanting part. So another bridge. I gotta put something over these bridges. It's too open for me, I think. Can you believe Enderman. this guy? He's your we, brother. Sure. You yeah. can't kill him. I'm gonna shake his hand. Yeah, shake hey, his buddy. hand. Are you guys hey, like buddy. cousins or something? Okay. Oh, lag. Oh, wow. Run away. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. So I, I'm down to like two frames oh per gosh. second right now. I oh can't my gosh, anything. that is probably from the uh, the um, sorting system. Really? Yeah, it lags so bad, but it's very very useful. But uh, yeah, this is my enchanting setup, and this Enderman's going oh, nuts go. here. I'll kill him. All right, thank you. I don't have any armor on. He's in the. Okay. Oh gosh. Dude, okay, he's gone. Oh god, the lag. <laughs> okay. But, Fix um, that. <laughs> what? Fix that. Uh, ah, I want not to my fault. <laughs> okay, so yeah, yeah, this is my enchanting setup. It has unnecessary bookshelves here. It's got very and some anvils over here. Yeah, that's basically it for my treehouse. I'm definitely going to be adding on some. Oh, he's back. Oh god, I'm lagging. Oh so gosh. Much. Oh no. Where is he? Oh, I killed him. Yeah. All right. So yeah, that's basically my treehouse, and uh, I guess we'll move on to the next house. Okay. Be right back. All right, we're at Blood Zealous's place, and it looks like he still hasn't cleaned up my prank here. <laughs> but uh, oh god, go ahead, talk. <laughs> stop yelling at me, Mags. <laughs> See, what people don't realize is Mags is actually a really terrible person. 
He beats me. It's true. It's yeah. true. He Get swears like corner. a sailor. Like, oh my god. <laughs> I think I should like do a viewer's discretion is advised or whatever before this. Max swears a lot. Definitely. Rated uh, a. <laughs> it's not rated E for everyone. <laughs> What's it like rated MA for mature or whatever? Mature I think audience. M seventeen or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> but uh Celis's house looks a lot like his shop. Mm-hmm. He uh he loves to build in this modern style with the sandstone and the snow and the leaves. Yeah. I really like the sandstone and snow. Looks nice. He needs to fill his house though. He doesn't do much interior, it looks like. Yeah. He's got and some over shows. here. Yep. <laughs> That's about it. Over here he has an unfinished farm too. Get on your farm, Zillows. Come on, man. And what's over here? Hey. I, uh, remember is, his, I remember this his This is his storage room, actually. Yeah. I think it's unfinished. It doesn't have a roof either. But In his uh, video, he was like complaining about how ugly it looked, and it looked really good. It looks nice. Look at this. Yeah. I like it. He's like, oh, it's so bad. I have to tear it down and redo <laughs> it. It's like, oh, you poor thing. It's, it's beautiful. Really Look build. at the side here. Yeah. I like it. But, uh, yeah, Zillos loves to build in the modern style, and uh, he needs to work on his interior. Come on, man. It's better than me but, still. <laughs> but I think we're going to go to Chris or Minecraft or May's house next, so uh, why don't we meet you there? Yep, be right back. All right, so now we're at Chris or Minecraft or May's house, and uh, he actually lives in a desert temple right next to a desert village. Pretty cool area. Yeah. So and he has some a, things over there. Yeah, he has some stuff over here, a horse stable and a big crazy jungle temple thing he's working on so let's check out his desert temple real quick first and uh yeah it's not it's pretty basic he just has some storage in the corners i guess yeah. furnaces crafting table bed it's like a temporary spot right now yep i think he's he's gonna move into that big thing you see him off in the distance there but uh i think he hasn't finished it yet yeah he's a pretty cool today. horse stable though though i really like it yeah double decker double decker horse stable and he has a donkey as well an h-bomb signature yep it's not mm-hmm. from me though he got that legit yep he did you can yeah, check his videos there's bomb. proof <laughs> all right so over here he's making this crazy like jungle temple ruin thing inside the mountain and he's using like cobble mossy cobble stone brick all that good stuff and even fire and vines but the funny thing is if we come up here on top of the mountain <laughs> You'll actually see that uh, he kind of cheated. <laughs> Such a the mountain's lie. a lie. Oh, God. Well, I think he might fill it oh. in, but I don't know. It still looks pretty cool from a distance, though. Yeah, you can only really tell from up here or from the sides. Mm-hmm. I like it. But, uh, yeah, Chris has spent a lot of time trying to perfect this entrance, if you guys have seen his videos. It's you so see, cool. he spent. He keeps, like, redoing it, but I think it turned out great right now. Yeah. So yeah, he, that's he basically. He does the craziest stuff. Like on uh, Mine Crew, he did like a, what was it? Uh, the, pumpkin the gigantic pie. house. Yeah, and then like the pumpkin pie maker, where he has like the stuff go, very very far away into unloaded chunks, and it's like, ugh. And then he has that. Uh, he had that crazy storage room before anyone else had it. Yeah. <laughs> He's very daring. He went where no man has ever gone before. Definitely. So. uh... <laughs> Uh, he has a pretty long tunnel, so why don't we cut to the next person's house? Okay. All right, now we're at the base of Grape Applesauce, and uh, we're in his Grapple Shack 2.0. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Upgraded. Mm-hmm. He has, like, the most resources on the team. Well, H is probably going to pass him soon, but uh, oh, God, check I this bottom no... chest here. Look oh, at that. Oh, my God. He has so much stuff. Look at all that iron. <sighs> what are these enchant... Oh my lord. You have to borrow this. This is fantastic. <laughs> He'll let you borrow his fortune pick if you need it. Oh no, I'm good. Alright, so it is nighttime, so we have to be pretty careful here. I've been dive bombed by a creeper off this mountain before. Yeah, I hear a zombie somewhere. I'm wondering where mm-hmm. he is. And if we go to the left of his grapple shack, you'll see a pretty large automatic wheat farm. So if you need wheat, this might be the place to come. Just click it. He has a do it? pretty what? Should we do it? Do it? Should we do it? Use it. <laughs> We're crazy. All right, we'll, we'll replant later. Yeah, off yep. camera. Mm-hmm. Pretty basic wheat farm, but it is works great, actually. Gives you a ton of wheat, by the way. Look at his chest. Mm. He has so much wheat. <sighs> I'm jealous of this kid right now. Mm-hmm. He's going to run out of room. Yep. You might have to take some, I mean. Uh, it's the I, nice thing to do. I mean, if I have to, okay. 
<laughs> All right. He does have a pretty cool tree farm, as you see over here. Um, and he has an iron golem in there for some reason. What is he doing? He's protecting the trees. Yeah, dude. They're, They're very like, delicate. Like and over here is his there. skeleton spawner. Oh, yeah, he showed me this. I actually spent a lot of time here before the Enderman farm was on the server. Yeah. Pretty good farm, I guess. Mm -hmm. It's a good place to get arrows. He has a chest full. He has everything. Chest below that. <laughs> yeah, chest below that. Oh, my lord. And um, there's one more thing at his base. I think he's actually moving, so he's not building here anymore, but uh, he's working on his new place. Oh, the cow farm. Yes, his uh, steak cookers. These are pretty cool. There's uh, cows in here. He breeds them. Oh. The babies actually go through into the separate water stream, get stuck in the mine cart, and once they grow up, they actually get burned and uh, fall, become steak and leather. So it's fully automatic. He doesn't need to tend to it. That's so awesome. Mm-hmm. It's actually a really cool design. It would be cool if he made, like, 20 of these and had them all go into one hopper system, maybe. That'd be insane. And probably a lot of lag, too. <laughs> mm-hmm. See, there's a creeper up there. Look at that. I've been dive bombed many a time. Oh, oh I shot him. him. Let's get him again. Oh, I got him. Ah. All right, so that was the base of Grape Applesauce. So, uh, um, let's, let's actually just head back because his yeah. tunnel's not that long. I'll come back and fix the seeds later. Yeah, we'll do it later. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna shut off the water here real quick. Let's see if it still has enough room. Might as well. We'll we'll replant in a second. Don't worry about it. Yeah. I just throwing the wheat in there. I took it okay, so uh, let's head back into the, his nether tunnel, and uh, this might trip you out, by the way. Oh, it's oh, the next two things. Oh dear lord. It's 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 purple, all purple. That's why the sheep were purple in the uh, in the in the in the sheep farm right at the beginning. Mhm. Mm I feel like I'm in the 80s right now. I'm not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. Do some disco. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, let's go to Joe or Tofu Gaming's place real quick. Okay, I don't see you, but hopefully but we'll, when we come through Yeah, he has a very you. short tunnel. Yeah. But um, if you actually go through his tunnel, there's actually a portal that leads to the Enderman farm. I can see you, by the way. Oh, okay. And uh, let's go to his base, and this might also trip you out. Oh, God, this is my nightmare. I hate oh coming my gosh. here. The dome. Uh. Oh, my gosh. Joe spent so much time. I can't see you, by the way. That's not a problem, though. Um, Joe <laughs> oh, spent okay, so much is. time. Just building this dome. I think he said like 11 hours and was like tons and tons and tons and stacks of glass. I can't even speak thinking of how much glass he used. It's speechless. And uh, yeah, he's got a lot of work to do in here. It looks awesome from the outside, but I feel really claustrophobic when I'm in here. And he has like floating trees on top of it and stuff. It's kind of ridiculous. Like there's like snow on top of that. Is that supposed to happen? I don't know. But um, okay. he has huge farms as well. And, oh, there you are. And if you come down um, into this cow farm, there's a little ladder here for some reason. Right here out of all places. Oh, Rip and Bear this, 2013. Where is I it? I think that was his dog. Yeah. He has a storage area over here. His base is basically just a big maze. He has the only cactus farm on the server as well. It's so useful. <laughs> mm -hmm. Green dye for days. Yep. And um, if we come to the other side of the storage room, I think you'll find a uh, sugar cane farm, perhaps. That's something blood. Yeah, I remember. Seeing Look at this, this door. Fantastic. God, amazing. Okay, so his sugar cane. There's a big open room here for some reason. Sugar cane right there. Oh, this is actually a pretty cool design. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that's basically Joe's base. So he has a very short tunnel, so I think we'll just go right to the last person on the server, which is the legendary Poke Digger one. Legendary. Legendary. All right, how do we get out of here? It's always confusing. Oh, the ladder's right here. <laughs> why does Board it... staken. I get it. Mm -hmm. Why is his entrance in the cow farm of all places? It's just ridiculous. Joe's a special person. Yeah. <laughs> Don't question him. By the way, when he was making the dome, he actually had to take down two full mountains. Other way. Oh god, that's that sounds horrible. He literally dug out two whole mountains. So where's Poke's base? I think it's right here. Um. Yeah. Yep. Poke Digger One's tunnel. His tunnel's not very long either. Just get just ignore that. Just go down the stairs. Okay. Oh, that was easy. Mm-hmm. And uh, his base is pretty unique. I think it's the only one of its kind on the server. He's kind of building in an abandoned mine shaft. Really? So, uh, yeah. He's doing kind of a nature theme in here. That's pretty cool. Oh, and that's you're awesome. invisible again. 
Oh no. But um, see the nether ward here? Oh yeah. Yeah, just come back here, and I think he has a zombie farm or something back here. I'm not sure. You just teleported through the wall, and mm -hmm. you're in the wall again. Okay. Wall you're invisible. Stupid nether nether uh, nether Glitches. portals glitch you out in the new snapshot. Yeah. Oh wow. You're and, climbing um, walls. You're have you seen? Have you seen his door? His door. No. Let's see this. All right. That's Watch cool. this. Oh, that's and really cool. You suddenly just appeared out of thin air. Hello. Okay, so watch this. <laughs> I believe Chris or Minecraft for Man actually helped him with this because he's great at redstone. Did you hear that little note block though? Yeah, what was that? That's it. When you open the door, it actually makes a little chime. That's awesome. And look at this. Oh god, why? There's so much digging. Everyone he's not even server. done yet. He has 19 layers left. Oh god. He's building a gigantic underground village. Oh god. Him and Joe and their crazy projects. Why does everyone like digging on the server? All right, so you with uh, your sheep farm, mm -hmm. Joe, and now Poke. Yes. Stop so it. I, I think that's everyone. Are we missing anyone? I don't think so. No, I think that's it. Now we got yes, one so special thing to do. What oh. is that? Hmm. I don't know. It rhymes with rither. Rither. Wow. <laughs> Huh. Wither fight. We want to get the uh, the beacon for the end farm so we can get regen and eliminate the need to eat. Yep. So, uh, awesome. we'll, so I think we're going to head to a desert and uh, probably go kill a wither and hopefully not die. Oh, you are underground. I am. Am I? Yep. <laughs> awesome. I'm going to sneak up on you like a shark. But um, yeah, we're going to go fight the wither. So uh, we'll see you there. All right. See you guys. What's going on guys? And uh, it's time to fight the wither, but uh, while we are going to do that, we actually stumbled across a spawner here in the middle of a desert mountain. Yeah, this is crazy. I mean, it's a perfect place for a skeleton farm. Look at that. So we should check it out. Let's this... get inside there. All right. Oh, skeletons galore. Help, help. Oh my God. Thank oh, God no. we have smite. Yes, my smite five is destroying them. I'll light it up Your real torch. quick. Okay. And nothing good. I'll take the piece of iron and that's it. There might be something behind here. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, Maybe. Sorry. Oh. oh, no. Nothing. That's All right, but I'm definitely probably going to make a skeleton spawner out of this. Perfect yeah. location and uh, yeah. There's no reason not to. It's like right up on the... Yep, right by my base. <laughs> We're actually right outside the my jungle that I built my treehouse in. So, yeah, so let's fight the wither, I guess. Where'd you go? Okay. You want to move over here, like, away from it a bit? Sounds good. Okay. Actually, let's move kind of far away. I don't want to ruin it. Okay. So, have you and fought one before? I have fought one before. I fought three at once before, actually. Oh, I actually think I remember that. I'm going to get rid of this lava. <laughs> All right. Sounds good. And by the way, people watching on my end, I got a bunch of new armor here to, uh, ensure, to ensure that I don't get destroyed. And I got this Smite 5 sword. Oh, yeah. So did I. Yeah. Do you have a strength potion? I do not. I just have Would you like one? I wouldn't mind it, no. <laughs> there you go. Strength two. All right. All right. Let's do this. Let's All right. Spawn him in. Do you want the honors? You can do it. You got the skulls. Okay. And what? we're going to use this beacon as a uh, regen beacon in uh, the uh, Enderman farm, right? Yep. Sounds like a plan. Okay, I'm going to back iron. up here. Okay, you ready? I'll get my bow charged. I take the potions while this guy is like... Oh. Getting up, just oh, whoops! <laughs> yeah, I always do that too. You go oh away from God. the bow. Mhm. Mm All right. Like so... when I place this, take them. Okay, I will. You get both of mine up there too. Oh, what? Oh, that's interesting. Uh, hover over potion of strength too. Yeah, it it gives you the uh, two point three attack damage, right? Yeah, is that new? Yeah, it's brand new actually. I think in the snapshot or something like that. Oh. Huh. It's it's actually very convenient. I like that. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm <laughs> taking the strength. And the region. Oh god! <laughs> no, get away from him. Okay, I backed up. All right, let's kill this guy. What? Ready? Go! Let's ah. get him. Oh, All right, I got my power him. five bow. It shouldn't be too much of a problem. I don't think I turned down my volume on the game. Oh no! <laughs> All right, we got him. We got him. We got him. He's on me right now. Yeah. He's oh. done. He's gonna come down, and now we yeah, gotta with swords. Yeah, destroy him with our smite swords. 
Smite's actually more effective oh. on a Wither than Shark. You hit me! Right? <laughs> what happened? You, you somehow hit me, I got set up. Oh shoot, he's straight up. Oh, he's right there. Okay. Oh, he's so done. He's so done. Oh, you got him. Did you get we the star? It. Oh, I got the star. Yep. Nice. Alright, so we destroyed uh, that wither. Uh, yeah, we How many did. hearts did you end up with? Uh, I'm at full. Oh, I, he only took a heart and a half from me. I wasn't paying much attention. The best so, part yeah. about this is sand. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so that's the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If yep. you're watching on my end, be sure to go check out H-Bomb's channel. Link in the description below. Same over to Minecraft. Or Magnetic Minecraft. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Alright, see you guys.